Hello guys, today I'm going to calculate weekly wage on an individual employee. If you wish to practice down below is a link to download the template. Tax code will be 1250L. Firstly we need to go to gov.uk to get the numbers of income tax rates and national insurance rates from 2019 to 2020. There is a personal allowance threshold of £12,500, which means we don't pay tax on first £12,500 of our gross wages. If our gross wages is between £12,500 and one penny and £50,000, basic rates apply which is 20%. To get easy calculation income tax we can work out to weekly taxable amounts by percentages. Forty per cent applies between fifty thousand pounds and one hundred and fifty thousand. and 45% if the gross wage is more than £150,000. Before we start it will be a good to break the rates into weekly rates to get easy calculation. If your weekly earnings are less than £166, you will not pay national insurance. Let's say basic hourly rate is £10 for a 40 hours a week. Overtime hours calculated times 1.5. Weekly gross wages will be sum of basic and overtime rates. To find out income tax we are using the IF function, and I will paste it down, and also will explain a all the formula. As I said before, if annual wages is less than £12,500 we not paying tax. If we take off £12,500 from £50,000 we gonna have £37,500 taxable amount. 20% of it and weekly we can find like Devi Ding by 52 which is 144 pounds and 23 pence. 
we know for 37,500 pounds the tax is 144 pounds and 23 pence so this 37,500 we gonna take off from 150,000 pounds and we will find higher rate which is 40% and that will be 865 pounds and 38 pence per week. Now if our annual salary is £160,000 so 45% will apply A only for £10,000 and the rest of amount we already know £144.23 plus £865.38 plus £86.54.
calculation of national insurance is similar as income tax, first £166 a week is a free then 12% apply from £166 to £962 and over £962 will be additional 2%. We using if function to find out national insurance. Net pay equals to gross wages minus income tax national insurance and other deductions if there is any like a pension. Thank you for watching and see you in my next video.